Thanks, man. Blessing to be back, man. Thank you all so much. Oh, that was lovely. Thank you. 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 Immediately takes me back to my original trip in 2018 whenever I spent so much time hunting and exploring in this mountain. But at the same time, I want to give a huge shout out to all my peeps in Fiji. If, if you were to drop me off right this second in Tevuni, Fiji or Gamea, Fiji, I could, I, I could go through that entire island like with my eyes closed. So we're having so much fun here in the Marianas amazing people and it's wonderful that my family feels so connected but to everyone in Fiji please know that I have not forgotten you and when these travel restrictions and COVID-19 is freed up I promise you my family and I and we're coming to Fiji and we're gonna see all of you and we're gonna explore all the places that I explored as a youngster and we're gonna make new memories and have so much fun but now check it out right there the Pacific Ocean Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful places. Can't wait to go see Mr. Lee. So we're just pulling up to Valentino's Hotel. This is where we stayed in our original trip. So my whole crew, everyone's gonna stay here. Me and Sarah and the girls, we're gonna have a little place, a little cottage down near the water. And uh, let's get unpacked. Hi, baby. Nice to see you. So happy to be back. Yeah, uh, sir, um, you have four rooms. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yoo -hoo! Hey, hey! <laughs> What's up, my man? Hey, hey, hey. What do you tell me? Next time I see you? Dr. Pepper, my man. So good to see you, Mr. Pete. Kill! How are you, boy? Right, buddy. 
Man, I was in bad shape last week, son. Off your, uh... Much better. Hey, hey! How are you? Okay, you guys. I told Mr. Pete, this is Mr. Pete Hulkalk, this is Kelvin. I told you the next time you saw me, I would have my family with me. This is Sarah. Hi, Welcome nice to meet you. And Emma. Nice to meet you. And Aria. I can't even express to you. I feel like I'm coming home here. Whenever I was here, there was just a little covered awning because the typhoon tore it down. All the flowers were gone. But that, that, that uh, sun drying rack, that was still there. This is what I want to do. Yeah. Can we go catch some small fish and dry them in the sun? Yeah. I got dried fish already, if you want. Yeah, but I want to go do it. I never got to see you do it. No problem. Yeah. For real. You guys, we are now in Rota. We've been up in the Northern yeah. Islands. We've been in Saipan. We've been in Tinian. But now, we're in Rota. And I'm telling you, Rota has a special, special place in my heart. Now to have my family here, Uncle Kill, <laughs> all my boys, man, we are, we're here, y'all. So, Can I time to get going. So, we've been in Rota now for about an hour. Went back, seen everybody, and this is the Senate President, Victor Hoko. Sir, how are you? <laughs> Not only is he the Senate President, I consider him a very dear friend. Uh, we've been using this lure a lot up north. It's a Nomad BTX Minnow, and a trip whenever you're fishing it. I fish about two to three feet of number 10 wire to a wind on leader. And when you're putting it in the water, make sure your drag is not locked up, but it's also not in free And just let it go on out, take it a little bit of drag. I fish it about, about 100 feet behind the boat. And then, instead of just locking the drag up, once it gets back to where I want it, I slowly push the drag forward until it stops. <laughs> Literally, you guys, we just got off the airplane, went and said hello to everybody. I saw Mr. Pete, and then Mr. Hulk Hulk, Senator, the Senate President, Victor Hulk Hulk, was like, hey, let's go fishing. So we just grabbed our gear, we just trolled out of the harbor, and if you look, that's the harbor right there. We've only been traveling, I don't know, daggum, nowhere. Hey, just keep it slowly in gear. This is gonna be dinner tonight, y'all. What do we have? Mr. Wahoo, nice Wahoo. Nice Wahoo. <laughs> Here I go, I'll, try, I'll bring him right to you. Hold on. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Here, Mr. Abel, hold on. There you go. Hold on one sec, hold on one sec. I got him. <laughs> got him. Get the little gap out of him. Hey, just like that, Mr. <laughs> Wahoo. We've been trolling for all of about 90 seconds. And as usual, I'm not even kidding you, <laughs> this has become my new favorite lure. That's a Nomad DTX. Well, something, I don't know. Okay. Wag him. Hold on. Him. You want to get... So we just got back to the house where we're staying and all these wonderful people are here. Now, I've been on Saipan, the Northern Islands, Tinian, and now I'm back in Rota. And I've got to be honest, coming back to Rota, Luta, man, it's like I'm coming back home. All these awesome people, these girls right here, look at them. See how pretty they are? They were there at the airport this morning dancing for us and welcoming us. Just everybody. Rhoda and the CNMI is all about family and culture and history and your roots. So, hey, PK. PK Hoko. Check that out right there. See that, y'all? There he is. That is Mr. PK Hoko. 
He is back in Kentucky right now. They're awaiting their second child, little baby girl. And uh, everybody, drop a thumbs up for Mr. P.K. Hokok because he is the reason I came to Rota in the very, very first place. What's up, my brother? I know you just woke up. Don't act like you're really away. <laughs> we just woke him up. It's like 5 a.m. there. Here you go. Hey, PK, I got to cook some fish, okay? All right. Okay. Let's cut some fish. This is the grill pit right here. We're cooking over tonga tonga wood. And I don't know if you all recognize, but that just looks like a, a rack that you might find in someone's garage, but it actually makes a great grill. Here's that Wahoo. The funny thing is, we caught this Wahoo in like the first five minutes of fishing. Once he's laying straight, have a good sharp knife. If your knife doesn't cut like that, it ain't sharp. You can come right here. See that? It's actually so sharp, it just cuts right through the, through the skin. Ooh. Now, one nice clean cut. You don't want to hack at it. If you're hacking at it, it's not going to be nice. Look at that, y'all. And that should lay right over. Beautiful Wahoo. Let me show you how to skin Wahoo. Cut it into a piece like that. And then what you have is you have your little pin bones right in the center. Just gently, gently, gently cut right down, but don't cut through the skin. When you get there, turn your knife out flat. You're gonna have your fish skinned. You may have a little piece like that. But now that fish has been skinned. Then turn it over, same thing. And then just, see that? And then, you know, if you're trying to be decorative, you can Clean that up like that. Clean that up like that. And now, we can cook it however we want. We're just gonna do that with the entire fish. What you making there? Sashimi. Sashimi? Yes, sir. Sashimi is one of the most basic foods that they eat all the time. Basically, raw fish with wasabi, soy sauce, and lime. Yes. And doni. And hot pepper. Hot pepper. You're gonna barbecue some, right? Yeah, okay. man. Yes. Now that's gonna be the sashimi. And all we'll take is we'll take some of these larger, larger chunks like that. And um, actually what I'm gonna do, I'll cut it right down the center, just like that. Look at that. Now it'll be a little bit thinner, which will allow this salt to get in there. Get a little bit of this. Ooh, black pepper. Yeah, that's all you need to do. Oh, oh, one went in the fire. Look at that. We got pork belly, short ribs, hot dogs. All kinds of good stuff, y'all. We're living high on the hog, y'all. I miss him. <laughs> Mm. There's something about that tongue and tongue of wood that gives everything such an amazing flavor. But look, you guys, this has been just a day in the life of deer meat for dinner. And not even deer meat for dinner. This is Robert Arrington, my wife, my family, my friends, and all the people here on Rota. We're having a great day. I appreciate you being a part of it, but that's all I got for you. We're gonna hang out, we're gonna talk, we're gonna fellowship and we're gonna do it all again tomorrow. And I hope you're here with us. That's all I got for you tonight.
Take care. God bless. And we gone.